Hey guys, still here and welcome back to more Wargame Red Dragon. Several years ago I was fighting Sniper Fire in a 1v1. Um, it was a random match in the sense that we randomly encountered each other as we were both playing ranked. Now, after years and years, we have a rematch. And um, <laughs> it's an interesting match. Let me leave it at that. You're not going to be watching the replay, you're going to be watching the live segment. And I am being coached by Wichter. Um, Victor, however, is not quite familiar with Sniper Fire's playstyle, and that leads to some interesting results. Now, um, watch the battle first. Um, try to not mind my saltiness too much. There is quite a bit of psychological warfare going on, even though Sniper may not have meant it to, but, um, well, I won't spoil it too much. And I will see you guys after the match to do a little bit of replay analysis. All right, different flank this time. Let's watch. Mm -hmm. All right, so I won't do as much as like sitting, but I'm gonna say like do some obvious mistakes. Okay. Okay. Great. So should I say hello, hello everyone? <laughs> you can if you want to, yeah. Hello everyone. Jin the bear. <laughs> Base defense by like after the game. Okay. Well, Next after the start maybe. I mean after the start, yeah. Especially like this is a friendly game, right? Yeah. So he shouldn't fly five tigers into your base like the last game. He shouldn't, but Sniper can be pretty cheeky with his flanking maneuvers. <laughs> also, uh, change the unit labels, please. It will really help you. I think it's infer the interface, I think. Uh, yeah, uh, and now uh, custom. What and just one? change labels merging to never. Okay. And now you see where your units are, right? Each yep. unit. It's really helpful. Okay. On that side you can only just send Erico and Spike. Yep. Because that covers all they need. It covers Recon, ATGM and AA. Mm-hmm. I'm planning on going a bit of light in the middle. If I can capture this, that'd be great with the uh, pan city. You just get it at the start, right? Yeah. You get this whole line at the start. And then the majority of the forces over here to Fedor. Okay. If you want to like get into that city in Fedor, use that road on the left. Right? This one and then there. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All these points, I'm not sure what to buy. Recon Hilo. Just to see what he's doing. He's Hero Moto, so he's not... Just start with uh, Sokol then. Maybe if he has a Tiger, right? Yeah, and just play them together. Hero Moto. Oh. Okay. If you try to push them or invest your forces into that push, right? So invest on the... What do you have here? Let me see. BMP2, KT, 1KT. KT, um, so you don't have any recon except that 1KT. So, Erico, definitely. Erico? Yeah, definitely. And uh, Mortar for the sm smoke on the tank. And on the left, I will just get like a spike squad into that city. Here? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Like 1KT, one, one spike here. And you just have enough points for a second CV to put in uh, the your two pointer. Yeah. I only got one tank here, though. But he's Moto, so 
he's not gonna have any of his tanks. As, yeah, uh, as long as he plays moto correctly, right? Because some people like use all of their tanks in the moto, that's weird. That's a lot of transports. I see like the Hilo aimed faster than yeah. the uh, AA, that's what I told you about. Okay. Now you can buy some base defense. And now I have no idea where to go. Put your stuff into buildings in the middle, like correct buildings. On the right, on the, in this building in the right. Like you need like at least one squad watching it. Yeah. Oh, he's using Dekum's group uh, as uh, his line. <laughs> that's, that's fun. Okay, watch out, the fox is now coming. Use all of your forces. Like, look, you, you have, yeah, wheel, BMPKT, just fire at the infantry with, with them. And help with that KT, they're dying. I a bit premature, I think, to buy that. Yeah. Be, uh, there, remember, there is like one Dekung's group squad going. There's one going all the way around. You need more infantry there. Fedora. In Fedora, you mean?
Where is he? Because he's not in Federer, at least not very much. Mm, he has plenty of forces. I think that he's just playing very de defensively. No, don't send an Alcuet. You don't need it. I mean, if he's going to play defensively, you can just reinforce your position. That's fine. A Moto deck needs to be aggressive. But remember, like, there's Deckung group behind your lines on the left, yeah. right? They can snipe that CV. You need to send, like, infantry. There is there. infantry on the way. Good. There's his CV. Okay, snipe it. It's over here. Uh, Uragan, probably. Just buy Uragan. You, you can afford it, right? Like, what's he gonna do? No need for romp there. No? no? Because the Why? Eryx is there. Yeah, Eryx is there and he's not attacking you. You also have fast forces, right? And yeah. he'll just bash his head against the wall. I would buy... If he's not going to attack you... Okay, snipe the CV. Stop and just fire a full salvo there. So he has some forces in mid. Okay, and then you can send some reinforcements to mid, right? Like... This is the where oh, tiers come in? I would buy infantry, just buy some infantry. Like... Uh, I'm not sure if your carrier the best answer. Okay, so he has like... Two Legion 90 squads here, probably, and like two Deckungs group. Mm -hmm. Judging by the transports and by the veterancy. Yeah. Just drive around him. If that thing can do it, I might be able to drop off Recon as well. Okay, I think you just killed his CV. Yep. Move your... Uh, yeah, to resupply. Good. Mm. Okay, now I say, if he's so defensive, right? Uh, we buy a second CV for Boris. Like put a CV there and put in like two squads of Yakari over here uh, in these towns. Yeah, just split them. go with that XA to Dimitri when maybe he has a Gypsy V and you can kill it, which is good. Just casually. I feel like I'm floating quite a bit with 180. Mm, don't worry. Get like a spike for that town in Feather. For that like one small building, see? Over here, there's like on the right. I have a spike there. But look on the right. Oh, that one. Yeah, that, it's like get one. You have so many points, like, and he's not yeah. doing anything. So, uh, and I would start preparing a push in the middle. So, like, mm -hmm. buy two M1 Wilks and buy like uh, more, like two more. St okay, he's putting his team there again. Okay, yeah, you know. Or look, okay, he, now he's moving it a bit. Farther away, yeah. Okay, and over here. Okay, so get like PTR 50s for middle. Uh, yeah. And now you'll just have this bowl of fire support plus the infantry inside, and that should just roll through him. Kurtz. Oh, I'd never see that unit, honestly. Wait, I gotta check. What is this? <laughs> what the oh, hold on. I'm losing units here. He has Wait, this building. He's this building? Okay. Uh, send a Hilo. 
Like, it's a um, gun system as well. Uh, PRC potentially. Yeah, send a hilo. No, send like uh, KT. Yeah. Unload the infantry. And uh, I would retreat the. Oh, see? I told you. Uh, send the transports in and the infantry. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, here's an RC behind it. Move the CP, move the CP. I told you, move the CP. The CP is gonna die. Move it just farther into the forest. Yeah, nice. Okay. And don't worry. This is just probably one hero. Oh, the sneak, the sneak, the sneak. Yeah, he tried to This is what he does. Yeah. Okay, but no worries. See? Okay. There's more. Okay, so he tried to sneak a lot. Okay, just. Yeah. Let's see. You kill everything. So you should kill everything. Okay, so where is that hero? You bought that or cancelled it on accident it, or something killed it? Something killed it potentially. Well, at least now we know where his forces are. No. He has them over here. You killed them, think? Not Move all of it. KT. Move the KT here. Move the KT and the Krk. Get the Krk over here. More forces behind your back. Blue dot in base, blue dot in base, blue dot in base. Oh my god, yeah, he has a... He has a lot, okay. Oh uh, well, if you're gonna play like this, like, yeah, uh, you need like, uh... Two KTs. No, no, buy KTs. And like, the one, the recon BMP KT and he snipes your CV here. So yep. Good. Okay, but if he spends so much time on sneaking, right? He made a mistake. This mistake that now we can attack him like from the other side. Okay, that's that. Move the ZSUs, attack with them, and he can't have much forces in mid. So unload here. Uh, unload that infantry near your near your CV so they recover it. And get them and get the infantry running in front and tanks and transports behind them and you should just get through him like butter okay. oh two jaeger escorts yeah 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 that's yeah. problematic yeah yeah go here get erico get the tank to face the other side get the tank to face the other side Okay, see? Tanks, tanks, you need tanks, man. See, you're chewing through them. Okay, get some AA in mid. Oh, he's going completely behind your lines. Probably lose everything that he has here. Put the spike in the building. Oh my For god. Fuck's sake. He's everywhere. <laughs> yeah. So dancing. Okay, uh no 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 no. You need a tank. And oh run, 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 run. Oh it's too late. It's it's too late, it's dead. Get the sock cool. Maybe it can nah, it's dead. Okay, just keep chewing through him in the middle. And send that romp to support your forces. Yeah. Oh. Your friend is kinda cheesy, my dude. <laughs> yeah, it's not unusual. Then the ramp or because he's Yeah, just move the ramp. You should just do it here. No worries. No worries. Move the Yakari so they kill the MX then, or CSB. What, the Pansari? No, the Yak uh, I mean the... The standard. The other Yakari, yeah. So now you just kill it, yeah. Too much. Okay, now move the Pansari. Now move the Pansari. Don't overextend, don't overextend. You have a good position here, don't overextend. Okay. Yeah, attack him from both sides, just push him into like a sandwich. Send KT middle, oh my god. <laughs> And it's like some AA in the middle, and you need to buy CB for like middle class. 
I don't think you killed that. You don't this thing is still yeah. alive. Yeah, so move the Panzer too. Just move the Panzer. They're all dying. Too late. Okay, but just should get the far streams. Get more infantry there. Get like two spots of Panzers. Get Ericos. Left, left, watch mid, I mean, watch middle. Commandos para. Kill them with the tank. And move forward with the Panzers on the in mid. Okay. <laughs> Not looking too bad anymore. Did you clear that I am extending in middle? I think so. I don't think so. Or maybe with the circle. Okay, so by uh, infantry CV. No, save for the infantry CV, it will be much safer. If you like put it into the building and just put like some shit next to it, it will be much safer. Okay, pull up the Pions in the middle and pull up the Ericos in the middle to Dimitri. I yeah, move them to Dimitri. Mi Wilk, your Wilk got killed. You didn't kill something here. Or they, he just got side shot from that side, yeah. It's not counter capping oh, Boris either. CV, 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 CV. No, CV first. Yeah, you're right. He's sticking on me. Oh, yeah, you see? Action in middle. Action in middle. Two Legion 90s. And two Tekken is good, but okay. That's interesting. Okay, you need more infantry in mid. Okay, get that. Get your. Dude. Will. Will. One of fives are part of a motorized? Yeah. Yeah, but they are not very good. Jeez, you still here? Yes, sniper squads here. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, why sniper teams? I think your wilk may be kind of fucked. Yeah, in the middle. So I would just, uh, yeah, yeah, probably just pull it back a bit. You did get the T-55 though. I know. Okay, uh, send your helos to Boris. You have some helos, yeah, you have like three helos. Send them to Boris. And try to get a CV in there. Yeah, infantry CV probably for the best. And send like one squad with KT. Okay. I think you can start, yeah, begin your assault over here. That's a good idea. I don't have anything like a tank though. Uh, you have forest here, so you should be fine. Also, put the spike in that building, please, in Federia, because it's still outside. But wait, there's more. Okay, no worries, no worries, that was just the mistral. And Jesus, that damn fight. near killed the CV. Yeah. Oh, oh they tigers. Found you. Yeah, they finally found you. Okay, get the KTs, you don't... Yo, if these if the cool group starts firing, he doesn't make. Don't run up with Eriko, yeah, and just get KT here. Would you get a CV into Dimitri? Uh, I 
would expand a bit, and then yeah, that's probably a good idea. But with stealth tanks for support? Yeah, like get like two of them, and get like more infantry in there, like like two panzi panziars with KTs. Yeah, and just try to capture like the other side of the road. Okay, attack, 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 attack. As chess masters always say, always attack first. War game really promotes aggression. Mm -hmm. Okay, and now you are back to capping. Uh, hide your CV. Get the MI17 to like protect it. Yeah, good. Also, Gonna get it fixed first. All... Yeah, see, we are just m m m rolling with him. Okay, uh, get your uh, helos to the pop. Set them ready. You should just roll through him because he pushed like you with everything he had, right? Mm -hmm. So now he should be an easy target. Okay, get uh, get a yay for mid because he has all these tigers. Get like 8 or 90 here and put it like the oh, no, on, see that edge on the forest on the right near that main road. Yeah, over here. Also on the left, Legion 90 micro against that. Oh shit. Okay, T died, and sadly. Yeah. Yeah, honestly, just go for it. Run away, run away with this. And he should be busy. Oh, did something die here? I think so. Move the panciers, move the panciers, dude. Look, you're getting them destroyed, mortared. Move them against Deckmoose group, yeah, try to kill the Deckmoose group. Okay. Honestly, yeah, let's just go over here. And when you get AA for me, you can even like mix it over there. And also buy CP for me too. Oh my god, this dude is sneaking so <laughs> It's too bad BDAs? What the- Get your other healers, get your other healers, because he's gonna die. Yeah. Why would you even sneak that? Okay, retreat your Panzers and the Ricos and try to repair them, try to repair them. Okay, now they too late. Contacts. Many. Ah, okay, don't worry. Oh. Spike copy. Oh my god, he was sneaking so much shit. Yeah, but wait, there's more. Fulsham Jaeger as well. Soon there's gonna be a CV arriving there. Fuck's sake. You gotta like attack them with like all the kilos at once, these buffs. Oh, that is way too aggressive, dude. Like, at least wait for this stealth tank, please. That is just okay. so much overextending. We don't have any recon. And move this Yakari to that forest on the left. Try to attack that. Yeah, this. Okay, he's trying to push you here. Uh, get that count. Yeah, it does like some firing position guns, please. And yeah, the HGMs are all out. Get, get MI17s there. Get MI17s there. Oh, your CV is gonna die. Okay, get the Wilk to shoot at it. And get the Pions to shoot at it. And now you can like start doing some pushes, some moves over here. Yay. Yeah. That. Oh. Ito survived at least. Okay, yeah, get the at least. Okay. Dude, but you gotta kill that shit behind your plan. You gotta all use the healers you have. Okay, don't use your will care careful, right? Oh, you're not. Jesus so Christ. Yeah, I told you. He also stop, killed the stop, tank. Stop, stop, stop. Yeah, because he has function in his dream. There, I told you. Not, don't send the tank. 
you, you killed your CV as well. Okay, get CV for a minute. Get CV for a minute. He Wait, what? Wasn't, he was thinking so much now he's gonna suffer. Oh, fuck me. Evening, Mia, you want to watch? May I yeah, 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 but I'm recording, so quiet. Okay. Okay. Uh, what are these? Okay, these are just some buffs. Okay. Get infantry moving. Get all the inf infantry in KTs in the pack moving. I think you broke his line. And get the eye to, eye to closer, yeah, and get the helos, just attack him. Yeah. Get the eye to, get the eye to. You need AA. Good. Or you're gonna die. Yeah, move it back here. And get the KTs, get everything. Just move. Tank. Okay, don't worry. There's some garbage deal. Oh my god, the crit, he's so lucky. Okay, try to kill that with the comps. Retreat. Retreat with us. Yeah. Also, I don't think you are microing on the right. The whole thing is falling apart. Okay. Don't worry, don't worry. Stop the healers. Yeah. I don't think he should have much AA. Unload the KT and try to move with it. Yeah. I'm still missing one tiger. Yeah, that one. Oh, God. Uh, fuck. Sokols! Sokols! No, Sokols are the fastest. Bal double Sokol at him, yeah. Uh, try to run away, try to run away. Try to run away with, into the buildings. Into the buildings. Screen building, yeah. Okay. Dead. Not so bad. Jesus Christ. No, don't move so aggressive. Move them by 17, please. Well, there's two them. minutes left. There's yeah. not a whole lot I can do. Oh, because he killed your CV, oh no. Yeah. I wasn't watching at the time, I'm sorry. Yeah, well, your friend is like ultra cheesy. <laughs> the ultimate cheesy. Yeah, but it works. I mean, it fucking works. You want revenge? I can play versus him. <laughs> I don't necessarily want revenge, I'm just pretty salty that it all worked. It you worked got units plans, fucking right? everywhere. Okay, there. Yeah, but look, there, okay. there, and there. <laughs> this kind of stuff like works once, right? Because like, when you know it's coming, that that's why I was so confused in the beginning, right? Because I just didn't know like, how, what is he gonna do, right? I was just confused, like, why is... Why, why he doesn't have any forces there? Or anywhere, pretty much, right? And now I know. Because he had them everywhere else. Yeah, exactly. So this kind of stuff, like, works. It's like hero, hero rush, right? So why is, why I don't consider, like, hero rush or shit like this a viable tactic in the game? Because it only works once, right? And once it worked one time, it's never gonna work again. Because you know it's coming, right? So next time we just have, like, 10,000 units on your flanks and it doesn't work. Yeah, it's not the first time I played him. That's the problem, and it just keeps working. <laughs> Jesus, fire already! The. I don't know, uh, the auto cannon on the Sokol is bugged. I mean, it's over anyway, because he killed your two-pointer city, so... <laughs> to be honest, like, you know that this kind of stuff is coming, right? Like, now there is, like, no, no way for your opponent to win, because it's just, you know... Predictable, and that's it. He just, he just killed your staff because he was just going behind your lines all the time. Right, welcome back to the replay. Um, that was some interesting gameplay. As I have mentioned, I got quite salty towards the end. And that had entirely to do with the, the feeling of powerlessness with sniper, fire, sniper fires units being sort of everywhere on the map. No matter where I looked, he had units. 
Let's go through the replay at high speed and uh, watch some more interesting moments. One of the things that I'm definitely still struggling with is when somebody is weak, sensing that, moving in on it, and making sure that I actually just capitalize on it. Because it's um, it's not great, and especially here, something does go entirely wrong. Anyway, I deploy my forces, as we have seen in the live video segment. We got Foxtrot covered. I have some forces going to Alpha over here, which, by the way, I do not offload in time. I should have queued the orders up. We got forces going to Bravo. Uh, very, very little, just a recon and uh, an HGM, just a spike. That's all. Normally, normally, a player captures the buildings over here, maybe over there. Sniper fire and his Eurocore motorized deck don't. Mistral, two AMX 10 RCs and a recon. And they just go off and drive towards the next map, I think. So I don't move at all. I could have pushed up, but I was micromanaging this side. And once again, I was trying to sort of headbutt my way through this sector. Over here, um, I have my forces offloaded, but they're not even in the building, so that too needs to get changed. But just watch what these things are going to do. I have my, my little skirmishes. I could have moved up with these things all the way to here, here and here, which would have given me a bit more control and potentially recon over the area here, especially the uh, Erico. Now my defenses, two ZSU-57s to the north and two to the south of my CV. Mistral still going. Interestingly, this thing has uh, quite a lot of maneuverability or autonomy, 600, but it's almost out of fuel. That's how far it's gone. One of the 10 RCs has been split off. Not sure it was running into mud or something like that. But it is doing exactly <clears throat> what this thing does best, which is harass my lines. Not yet, but soon. Super Puma almost flew over the Mistral. It didn't actually fly close enough for the Mistral to launch, but it was pretty close. Now he moves up, he moves up, he moves up. Here comes the 10RC. He's just waiting to pick off my units. The BTR dies, leaving the Yickety. The other BTR is also going to be getting shot at. And there we go. The CV just narrowly ducks back into cover. The 10RC... Highly problematic over there, because I could not counter it. Normally, I would then call in a helicopter. The helicopter, which would promptly get killed off by the Mistral. The 10RC over there has been taking a bit of damage after a skirmish with the 57s. My CV is still fine. But I call in a KT, MI8 KT, and it dies. The Elouette also will get the same treatment. It dies. Another Amex 10RC the one that was split off, is now intercepting just whatever I happen to spawn in, but thankfully one of the 57-2s kills it. Over here, we still have the other 10RC on the loose, and effectively I was just being harassed by three units. An Amex 10RC there, an Amex 10RC over here, uh, the Commando Parrot died very quickly and the Mistral is still there. That was all that he had, but it was such a huge distraction that the management of the forces over here completely took a backseat. And watch what he's doing here. He probably knows that in a one-on-one -on -one fight, like a straight-up fight between my buildings here, he can't win. So he's just ignoring the whole position. He kills my mortar because it was way too close. And we got uh, a small surviving section of Deckungsgruppe moving up. There's uh, VAB VDAAs, there's Fuchs Melans. Over here, the units are getting intercepted by Falschmjäger. And in meanwhile, I'm making some headway into the middle, but... <laughs> Ouch. This is such an open area. There is nothing there. And I didn't capitalize on it at all. Well, maybe a little bit. I did send out the Ferns, uh, sorry, the uh, Erico. Interestingly, there's a Fern Spayer. I'm not sure why. I don't really see the benefit of having a Fern Spayer there because these guys have exceptional stealth. But 
what are they supposed to spot? Like, I, I don't quite get it. Maybe a helo? And at this point, I still have the Mistral on my line. Fortunately, I'm not using this road, but it is definitely spotting stuff. My artillery has since died. There's Deckungsgruppe over there. The VAB VDAA have moved up. Falschemjäger have moved up. He is making some very, very skillful use of the terrain. And because of that, anything and everything that I move in gets detected and or shot at. Currently, the Deckungsgruppe are not in a position to fire, but they soon will be. And more importantly, I then send a MI-8KT over there. And the VAPs go, yeah, thank you very much. That's, uh, that's very genuine, very, very generous. And uh, here's your helicopter back in pieces. Hardened. Fallschirmjäger. I send out more BTR to reinforce this position. Not quite aware, and that's entirely my mistake, that there are units over there. So what promptly happens is that the VABs, uh, well, they're almost empty in their entire magazines. Um, and they just intercept anything that spawns in. Fallschirmjäger, ZS57 or CSU572, killed. And there's a Wilk, and they kill that as well. <clears throat> this is terrible. This is absolutely terrible. The MI-17 flies over. This one kills the Fallschirmjäger. That one gets killed by the last of the ammunition of the, v, uh, the VDAAs. A drop of the Spado. And now I'm afraid of units that are out of ammo. It was just an overall shitfest. And then the Tigers arrive. This was actually the same day as uh, the other guy rushed me with the Tiger. So I... Yeah. I was not paying attention to helicopters, um, even though I got killed. I think I lost three CVs to helicopters in that first match. And then I promptly have it happen again. A tiger and a tiger hap, that's all. But sniper's ability to attack basically everywhere at the same time is something that I really need to master. He had forces over there, here, units flying around. He's micromanaging, or at least managing, quite a lot of units. And of course, at this point, the game is up. I have nowhere to go. Uh, his CV over there is pretty well defended by Kurtz's, Vabs, <laughs> Roland's. It's like he's expecting some sort of offensive uh, from the side. So I go through the front door, and even then I cannot find the CV. So, psychological warfare. I gotta make sure that if I see... Well, nothing. And especially early on in the game, I thought, where are his units? Well, they were behind my lines almost the entire time. And that cost me the game. So well played to Sniper Fire. Uh, poor play by me. And I will hopefully learn from this and make sure I do better next time. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you soon for more videos.